Hi guys, Sarah May here from Baja Surf Yoga, and I made a really fun flow for you guys today. Um, this one is pretty athletic, so intermediate to advanced asana practitioners. I'm not going to talk too much because it's all about the music. So here's how this works. Scroll down, find the Spotify playlist under this video post, hit play, and then run back to your yoga mat and we will get started. All right, have fun with it. Peace. Welcome to Baja Surf Yoga's classic flow. This flow is meant to partner with our classic playlist on Spotify. So if the link is not below you on this video on YouTube, go to our blog and find the video and the playlist there. And it's all about the music today. So choose bliss, have fun, and enjoy. We're going to start by sitting down comfortably on our mat. Cross-legged or on the knees, it's up to you. Just the spine long and tall. Eyes closed. Breathing easy in and out through your nose. Take a few moments here to settle the energy of the day. Get centered, get grounded. Every exhale breath, letting go a little bit more down into your seat. Every inhale breath, feeling that lift up through the chest or the crown of the head, lengthening the spine a little bit more. Noticing into that ebb and flow of the breath. Like music, music to the soul. Good place here to set intention, purposeful intention for class today. Give yourself a single point of focus. And it could be as simple as I will enjoy, I will listen, listen to my body, listen to the music, listen to the soul. And then inhale, sweep the arms up, look up, open the eyes. With exhale breath, side bend, one arm down, the other up and over. Get playful a little bit with opening the heart perhaps or play with the arms. Inhale up through center. And then exhale, side bend, opposite direction, stretching the side body long. Inhale back up through center. And then exhale, plant the hands, shift to all fours. Knees, hips width under the hips, hands under the shoulders. And then breath in, cow pose, send the heart forward, gaze up, shoulders back. Exhale, cat pose, rounding into the back of heart space. And then back and forth with your breath between these two shapes or taking any of the in-between shapes that you would like. Just moving with your breath, the music of the breath, and the music itself. Always moving in a way that feels good to your body. From these cat cows, we'll eventually return to a neutral, a neutral spine. And then big inhale breath will extend the right arm forward, left leg back. And with exhale, squeeze in the elbow to the knee. Inhale is an extension. Exhale breath, squeeze in. Inhale, get long in the limbs. With exhale, engage the core, hug in. One more breath to extend and then return to all fours. Same thing, other side. Inhale, left arm forward, right leg back. Exhale, hug in. Breathe in, reach. Exhale, squeeze. Inhale, lengthen. Exhale, squeeze in. One more time, reach out and then return to all fours. 
And then from here, cat-cowing your way back to downward facing dog. Taking the movement that you need to settle in towards this down dog shape. Give it a little bit of time. And then from down dog, slow baby steps to rag doll at the top of your mat. Soften the knees, hang in a forward fold. Take a bind of grabbing opposite elbows in front of you, behind you. Perhaps some movement, side to side sway. And then inhale, breath, half lift. Exhale, deeper forward fold, release the head. Inhale, rise up, mountain pose. Exhale, hands to the heart. Inhale, Tadasana. Bring the big toes together to touch. And then exhale, chair pose. Sit back into the heels, hands to the heart. Go in deep in the hips, deep in the knee bend. And we'll move further down as we open the arms, palms face up to the sky, and find Navasana, boat pose. So flex or point the feet. Get active through the spinal column, lengthening there by lifting up through the heart, the breastplate. Palms to the sky, collarbone wide, hold and breathe in. And then exhale, rock it back, knees to the chest. Take a little breather, release. And then rocking and rolling, rocking and rolling, up and down along the length of the spine to high plank pose. From here, decide which type of transition best serves you as you shift back to downward facing dog. Always making your own transition there through chaturangas. Today is all about moving how you like to, what feels good, rather than what you think you should do. So with inhale breath, we'll look to the front and then have fun as you make your way up to forward fold. Breath in, half lift. Exhale, fold in deeper. Inhale, rise, mountain pose. Breath out, hands to the heart. Inhale, mountain pose again, belly up and in. Exhale, chair pose. Open the palms to the sky, slowly sit the hips to Navasana. And this time we'll take a lift and lower. Exhale is low boat, hollow belly hold. Inhale, high boat. Exhale, lower. Inhale, high boat. Take five or seven or ten is what we're doing here. But you choose your own pace. Quality over quantity. This will be an athletic flow. So we're warming the core right here, right now. Eventually lifting up to a high boat hold. Opening the heart a little bit more. And then rocking and rolling up and down. Cross ankles, plant hands. High to low plank, a heart opener, and an exhale down dog. Inhale, breath. Look to the front. Exhale, breath. Forward fold. Inhale, half lift. Open the heart. Breath out. Fold in a little deeper. Inhale, mountain. Rise up. Exhale, hands to the heart. Breath in mountain, breath out chair. And then palms to the sky, slowly bring sits bones to the earth, Navasana, boat pose. This time hands behind the head, elbows wide, we'll take a few twists. Elbow to the opposite knee, and the next leg can go out long, long, long. We're doing 12 here, but you move at your own pace with your own breath. Eventually, we return back to center, lift the heart, and then thighs to the chest, rock and roll up and down. Rolling it all the way through, high to low plank. Inhale, heart opener. Breath out, downward facing dog.
Inhale, look to the top of the mat. Exhale, breath, come to forward fold. Breath in, half lift. Breath out, fold in deeper. Inhale, rise, mountain. Exhale, hands to heart. Inhale, mountain pose. Breath out, chair. Inhale, open the palms to the sky. And then exhale to Navasana, boat pose. Breathe and lift the chest. One time we lower and lift and then rock and roll up and down through your vinyasa, returning with exhale breath to downward facing dog. From downward facing dog, Inhale, breath, right leg long to the sky, and then exhale, knee to the nose. Stay for breath in, and then exhale, right foot steps down. Inhale, high lunge, reach up. Exhale, cactus the arms, lower the hips. Breath in, reach up again. Exhale, lower. Inhale, lift. Exhale, lower, five on each side. Breath in, lift up. Exhale, lower, back knee can bend. Inhale, reach up, and then breath out, warrior two. Open and adjust the feet. Inhale, breath, reverse, warrior, right arm up and back. Exhale, breath, side angle, right arm towards earth, left arm towards the sky, heart open. With inhale, breath, we'll send, push the right leg long and straight, Trikonasana, triangle pose, still heart open. Breath in, rise up, turn the right toes in, exhale, wide-legged forward fold. Release the crown of the head to the earth, make this shape your own, take a little side-to-side -side movement if it feels good. With inhale, lift halfway, crawl the hands to frame right foot at the top of the mat, and then breathe in, right arm to the sky, low lunge, twist. Exhale, plant the hands. Inhale, tripod down dog. Right leg goes back. Exhale, high to low. Breath in. Chaturanga Dandasana. Exhale, down dog. Breath in, left leg. Long to the sky. And then exhale, knee to nose. Stay for the breath in. Exhale, plant left foot down. Breath in, high lunge, and then exhale, lower the hips, open the heart. Inhale, lift. Exhale, lower. Five times again on this side with your breath, your pace. Inhale, lift. And then exhale, warrior two to open up. Left foot forward this time and adjust your feet. Inhale, breath, reverse warrior. Hold the left hip low as the left arm reaches up and back. Exhale, side angle. Inhale, triangle pose. Press the left leg long and straight. Maybe lift up out of that side lean just a little bit. With inhale, we'll rise up, turn the toes in, exhale, wide-legged forward fold. Inhale, breath, half lift, exhale, crawl to frame the left foot, top of your mat, and then inhale, left arm to the sky, twist. 
Exhale, plant hands. Inhale, tripod, down dog, left leg lifted. Chaturanga Dandasana to downward facing dog. Inhale, right leg. Exhale, knee to the nose, step through. Inhale, high lunge. Exhale, lower the hips. Inhale, reach. Exhale, lower. Inhale, reach. One more time, lower. Inhale, reach. Exhale, warrior two. Breath in, reverse warrior. Breath out, side angle. Inhale, Trikonasana, stay for the exhale breath, adjust. Inhale, rise up, toes in, breath out, wide-legged fold. Inhale, half lift, breath out, crawl to the front, low lunge. Inhale, right arm to the sky, twist. Exhale, plant the hands. Inhale, Ekapada, Chaturanga Dandasana or any transition that serves you as you go back to down or down. And then inhale, left leg to the sky, breath out, step through. Inhale, high lunge, exhale, lower. Inhale, reach up, exhale, drop the hips. Inhale, lengthen, one more time to lower, breathe in, lengthen. Exhale, open, warrior two. Inhale, reverse. Exhale, side angle. Inhale, triangle. We stay, adjust for breath out. Inhale, rise up, toes in, breath out, wide-legged fold. Inhale, half lift. Exhale, low lunge, breath in, left arm skyward. Exhale, plant hands. And then make your way back to downward facing dog. This time, inhale, look to the top. Exhale, breath forward, fold, feet together. Inhale, half lift. Breath out, fold in deeper. Inhale, chair pose. Strong in the chair pose, heart open, hips lower. And then exhale, plant hands, crow pose, bakasana. A little playful here. Cat pose the spine, squeeze the big toes in and up. And then option a transition from here to down dog, any way you would like to. Inhale, right leg high, breath out, step through. Inhale, high lunge, exhale, cactus arms, lower hips. Inhale, reach, exhale, warrior two. Inhale, reverse, breath out, side angle. Inhale, right leg straight. Exhale, rise all the way up and forward fold. Breath in, half lift. Breath out, crawl to the front. Inhale, right arm skyward, twist. Exhale, plant the hands. Plank to down dog or full chaturanga. You choose every single time. Inhale, left leg. Exhale, step through. Inhale, high lunge. Exhale, lower the hips one time. Breath in, high lunge. Exhale, warrior two. Inhale, reverse. Breath out, side angle. Inhale, triangle pose. Stay for breath out. Inhale, we rise up, toes in. Exhale, wide-legged fold. Inhale, half lift. 
Exhale, crawl to the front. Breath in, left arm skyward. Exhale, plant the hands. And then chaturanga or plank pose hold to downward facing dog or any variation. Inhale, look to the front with breath out. Come to forward fold. Inhale, half lift. Exhale, fold. Breath in chair pose. Slowly, slowly, slowly lower the hips to Navasana. Keep the heart open. Collarbone wide. Lift the chest. And then option to bring elbows down to the earth. As we play with a few leg raises, lifting and lowering. Keep the heart open here the whole time. Pressing the chest to the sky, shoulders down and back. Legs are long and active, whether the feet are flexed or the toes are pointed. And then hug the knees into the chest. Roll back. Give yourself a breather. We rock and roll. Up and down. Step it through. And land in downward facing dog. Inhale, right leg skyward. Exhale, right foot comes to the outer right arm. Inhale, right leg reaches back. Exhale, step through. Inhale, high lunge. Exhale, airplane the arms this time. Send the heart forward. Inhale, reach up. Exhale, forward lean. Sweep fingertips back. Inhale, reach up. Exhale, reach back. Inhale, reach up, a neutral spine, and then exhale, warrior two. Same flow, inhale, reverse. Exhale, side angle. Inhale, triangle. This time, exhale, just sweep the left arm down, forward fold. Breath in, half lift. Breath out, crawl to the front. Inhale, back to high lunge, we return, and then take a prayer twist on this side. Hold the prayer twist. Then release to lizard pose. Wiggle the feet out, a little wider, a little longer stance. Right knee down or right knee lifted. Palms down or take the elbows, the forearms to the earth. Option to reach right arm to the sky or reach all the way back to left foot for a little quad stretch. Just open and spacious in the body. From lizard, shifting on to the left arm, side plank. Any playful side plank variation here. And then with control, the right foot steps behind you. We open up to a wild thing. Play with the right arm or stay as you are. And then flip back to tripod down dog. Take your vinyasa or just lower that right leg down, downward dog. Inhale, left leg long to the sky. And we can take that same left knee, left elbow or step it right through. Inhale, high lunge and then airplane arm lean. Inhale, reach up. Exhale, we lean. 
Inhale, reach up. Exhale, forward lean. Breath in, reach up and around the exhale, warrior two. We inhale, reverse, and then exhale, side angle. And then inhale, back to triangle pose. From here, just an exhale breath, sweep it down, wide-legged forward fold. Inhale, half lift, lengthen, breath out, crawl to the front. Inhale is high lunge, high lunge, sweep arms up. And then exhale, prayer twist. Holding and adjusting prayer twist as we breathe. And from prayer twist, we release to lizard pose or runner's lunge, right? Hips lowered, feet out wider, feet out longer. Any variation. Maybe the right knee comes down as left arm reaches to the sky or all the way back for right foot quad stretch. And then we shift from our lizard towards our side plank, the right arm down, the left arm to the sky. Any playful variation with the top leg, tree pose, left foot to the sky, or left foot lands behind you, and we press down into the feet, wild thing, open the heart. And then flip it back, tripod down dog, left leg lifted, chaturanga, or just lower the left leg, downward facing dog. This time with inhale, look to the front, exhale breath, forward fold, inhale half lift. Breath out, fold in. Inhale, chair pose. Big toes touching, knees together. We'll take the hands to the heart. Prayer twist. Open arms if you'd like. And then hips can stay low as we come back through center, reset. And then twist to the opposite side. Open the arms or get playful. Breathe in, exhale, forward fold. Inhale, half lift. Exhale, high plank to low. Breathe in, heart opener. Breath out, downward facing dog. From downward facing dog, a little bit of core work here, core work. A few times, we'll take an inhale, shift forward, high plank, and then exhale, downward facing dog. Inhale, high plank. Exhale, down dog. Inhale, high plank. Breath out, down dog. Inhale, high plank, holding here, strengthening high plank. And then with exhale breath, it's right knee to the back of right wrist. Step back, left knee to left wrist, step back. One more on the right, one more on the left. Downward facing dog. Child's pose, a little breather, a reset.
from child's pose, returning to down dog, right leg goes to the sky, and then that same plank shift. Hold right leg lifted as we take down dog to plank shifts. Maybe a little bit of chaturanga arms, starting that elbow bend, and then downward facing dog. Bringing the right knee to the right wrist, we'll reach back, right leg to the sky. Take a few of these, three on each side, and then return to downward facing dog. Same thing, left side. Left leg goes high to the sky. We keep the left leg lifted as we play we're shifting to a one leg high plank come back shift weight forward onto the hands or chaturanga arms shift back one more time forward shift back and then it's left knee towards the left wrist the left shin hovers back to one leg down dog two more times on the left side Down dog, breathe it out. Inhale, hop to the front of the mat. Exhale, forward fold. Breath in, half lift. Breath out, fold. Inhale, chair pose. Hands to the heart. We'll take that twist a little shorter this time. Open the arms if you'd like to. Breathe in, rise up, and then exhale, twist to the opposite side. Open the arms if you'd like to. Get playful. Inhale, rise all the way up, and then exhale, forward fold. Breath in, half lift. Exhale, plank to down dog, or take that full vinyasa. Downward facing dog with exhale breath. Come to the front one more time. And resting here in a forward fold. From a deep forward fold at the top of your mat. Inhale, half lift, and then fold again, breath out. Inhale, rise, mountain pose, exhale, hands to the heart. Standing balance, we'll inhale, lift up through right knee, flex the foot, parallel right thigh to the earth, and hold here. Still on the left leg, sweep the right heel back to the space behind you. Hands can stay at the heart or reach forward. Warrior three. Inhale, sweep the right knee up and through again, perhaps without touching down. And then exhale, take that right foot back again, this time reaching to the inside of right foot with right arm, and then lifting up dancer's pose. Imagine right leg, left hand might meet each other behind your head. Without touching down, sweep the right knee back and through again. And then reach left arm across to right thigh, opening right arm behind you for a twist. Option to take the left hand to the knife edge of right foot and extend the right leg. Hips forward, heart sideways. From here, we'll guide the right foot to a tree pose. Hands to the heart or your most favorite tree pose variation.
Exhale, breath, feet come down. And we return the hands to heart center. Samastiti. Inhale, left knee lifts. Left thigh parallel to the ground, balanced here. Exhale, send the left leg back, warrior three. Hands stay at the heart or reach forward. Without touching down, bring the left knee up and through again. And then next time the left foot sends back, kicks back, it's dancer's pose. Reaching inner left foot with left arm, right fingertips towards the sky or right fingertips also back towards left foot. Sweep the left knee up and through again to the front. And then right hand to left thigh. Open the heart to the windows. To the side of your space. Take the leg extension if you prefer. And then we guide the left foot back to tree pose. With exhale breath, hands to the heart, feet return to the earth. So take a moment of pause here, and then we're going to get playful. Inhale, arms sweep up. Exhale, right knee lifts. Inhale, warrior three. Exhale, back to that foundational balance. Inhale, dancer's pose. Move with the breath. Exhale, back to right knee through. Inhale, twist, open up. Exhale, tree pose, hands to the heart. Breathe in, reach the arms up. And then exhale, both feet down, samastiti. With breath, next side. Inhale, sweep the arms up. Exhale, hands to the heart, left knee lifts. Inhale, warrior three. Exhale, bring the left knee up and through. Inhale, reach back, dancers pose. Exhale, left knee comes through again. Inhale, twist. Exhale, tree pose. Place the leg and then breathe in. Sweep the arms up to the sky. Exhale, breath. Hands to the heart and we return to Samastiti. Equal standing pose. Breathe into Dasana. Exhale, Uttasana, forward fold. Inhale, half lift. Breath out, Chaturanga, or plank to down dog. Then we'll use the next song to get a little playful with some arm balances. So whatever you choose to do, and this could just be child's pose, we can bring elbows down, play with a little forearm stand. Child's pose, of course, if you need the rest, need the break. Plenty of space here to work handstands, to work headstands, to just work the prep of crown of the head to the ground and strength driving down to the elbows and the forearms. Working the prep of simply stacking the hips over the shoulders. And if you're working a headstand, Perhaps a knee-wide variation for a little more stable base. 
And if you have a great headstand practice, working the exit, working the controlled exit as well from wherever you are. Taking child's pose between moments of playfulness or child's pose through this whole song. Wide leg variations of headstand. Working the lift, working the lower. Always aware of what the energy of the body feels like and whether it's more wise to just rest and take child's pose. And then child's pose, of course, we can always sweep the hands behind to cup the heels. Knees out wide or knees together. Eventually rising up towards knees together, seated on the heels. Reach the hands behind you, press the heart to the sky, little baby heart opener here with fingertips tented or bring the heels of the hands all the way to the earth. Heart skyward, shoulders open or option to lift the hips as well. Little movement there, just pressing hips and heart to the sky. And returning to seated on knees as you need to. That same heart opener again, we can take by just reaching hands back towards the earth. Or perhaps a camel pose, rising up towards standing on the knees. Hands can go to the low back. Hands can interlace behind you, reaching knuckles down towards the earth. Or we can reach all the way back, fingertips to the heels. And then just pressing the hips forward, heart skyward. Chin towards the sky or holding the gaze to the front of the room. Mindful exit as you're ready. Coming straight back up out of this shape before untucking the toes and then sitting back to the heels again. Hands can rest in the lap and breathe. Sit the hips to either side, bring the legs around in front of you and then come back to the elbows again as we did before. Heart skyward, legs long, we lift and lower, toes pointed or toes flexed. Active in the legs, open in the heart. And then single leg, lift and lower. Left leg stays skyward as we work the right side. Switch. Right leg stays skyward as we work the left side.
and then back to both legs. Straight leg lift and lower. We could always do this bent knee. And when you're done, we'll roll all the way down to the back. Setting up for a bridge pose, plant the feet, bend the knees, palms face down by your side, and we'll lift the hips. Option to interlace the hands behind you, wiggle onto the triceps, the shoulders. And then slow, bring the spine back to the ground. Let both knees windshield wiper over to the left, nice and slow, over to the right. Taking your time here, a little back and forth. And then we'll set up again for another bridge pose or a wheel. Heart opener of your choice. If it's wheel, chin to chest as you come back down. And then Baddha Konasana this time, Supta Baddha Konasana, soles of the feet together, knees and butterflies. Allow yourself a rest. And we'll draw the knees in. Rock and roll up and down, move through full vinyasa or take it back to down dog. From down dog, if you down dog to plank shift. Work into inhale with high plank and then exhale back to downward facing dog. From high plank, we'll swing that right knee behind the right wrist again and set up for half a pigeon pose. Upright or coming to a forward fold if you're ready for a more heart down, forehead down, moment of rest. From half pigeon, hands back to the top of the mat, downward facing dog. Perhaps a few high plank to down dog shifts again. And then from high plank, left knee to left wrist, left shin across the top of the mat. We'll set up for our half pigeon pose and then take that forward fold.
And then hands back to the top of the mat. Downward facing dog. From down dog, we'll walk or float or step it through to seated at the center of our mat. Paschimottanasana, we'll take the legs out long in front, sweep the arms to the sky, and then exhale for a forward fold. Grabbing the feet, the toes, the calves, the legs, or at this point, just releasing the arms to the earth and letting go. And from our Paschimottanasana, reach the hands back behind you. Legs long or root the feet under the knees and then press up reverse tabletop. And then with exhale breath, we'll lower the hips back down and slowly, mindfully roll all the way down to the back. And then from the back, knees drop towards the armpits. We'll take a little happy baby here, grab the feet or the back sides of the thighs. And from your happy baby, legs up the wall, feet above the hips, knees can be bent, but heels to the sky. And from the legs together, legs up the wall, we can bring the feet out wide, grabbing or letting gravity just draw the thighs down, take you into a hip stretch. Knees draw together again, and then an easy supine twist. Legs go one way, the chin goes the other way. Any leg variation. Eventually knees back to center, find neutral and then switch sides. The top leg can extend for a little more leverage there. Taking a feel good supine twist.
And then we'll take knees back to center again, back towards the chest. This time, give yourself a final squeeze. Could be a super tight squeeze, hugging across the shins or grabbing to the opposite feet. Forehead or nose to the knees, even lift up through the back of the heart. Exhale out to Shavasana, expanding again, and then resting back and enjoying the music, using this time to listen. Listen to the body, listen to the soul, Listen to all the sounds within and around you. And of course, it is home practice. You can rest here in Shavasana, let the playlist play out. Stay here for as long as you would like. If you're ready to begin closing your practice, find the breath again. Bring little awakening movement to the body. Take a nice full body stretch, point the toes, arms overhead, and the knees into the chest will roll to one side. A little pause here for gratitude, for the music, for the practice, for the body itself. We'll rise up to a seat and then close by dedicating all the bliss and joy experienced here to the benefit of all beings everywhere. Take any final movement that you need to awaken back into this body, this form. And then bring your hands to the heart. Om Ah. Thank you for joining us for our rock and roll classic practice. We hope you had as much fun as we did. And we'll catch you on the flip side. <laughs>